What's up everybody? It's Deron Black again with a brief political commentary for you. I just want to educate you a little bit about what goes on on the dark side of politics. Just recently, Governor Grimes was mentioned in the Kansas City store about a nonprofit organization that he seems to be pretty close to. Now, when you talk about close, I believe that the Kansas City Star reported that Governor Greiden's former campaign staff member is actually the one who set up the nonprofit organization. Now, nonprofits are not necessarily a bad thing, but when we talk about politics and the closeness to political officials and nonprofits, we're getting into a very shady area called dark money. I don't know if you ever noticed, but politics has been kind of skewed in a way to the right, very radical, very controversial in my opinion. So, dark money allows for campaign contributions to be made for political agendas that don't necessarily show up on reports. That can be very dangerous. Your government could actually be funded by a very small group of individuals who have a very stern political agenda. Now, I'm not trying to accuse Governor Grimes of any wrongdoings, but if you just take a look at some of the ethics reports, you might tend to think that you know, there's a possibility that things could be going wrong. So anyway, nonprofit organizations and political officials being so close together is not a good thing. So I encourage you to check out that uh, May 18th edition of the Kansas City Star. Read up on that report. Lynn Horsley is the lady that actually did the reporting. Uh, she does a great job in her reports. And follow that dark money because we could be seeing some very shady things going on here in Jefferson City. All right. Peace. I'm IFBB Bikini Pro Cat Williams, and when I'm not working out in the gym, I'm searching the web on Cascade Media and What's Up Kansas City. So make sure you check them out.